Don't tell the Tommaso road bikes or tri bikes, but the staff at Tommaso thinks that the carbon Diavolo cross bike might be the best bike we've ever made. Let's check it out. For starters, the Tommaso Diavolo comes in a 12K high modulus monocoque frame. It's a light frame, it weighs just barely over a thousand grams, so you're looking at about 2.1, 2.2 pounds. Uh, very light, but yet uh, oversized tubing to make good for solid handling and acceleration. And it even has a nice monocoque, full carbon fork, blades, and steer. So we know the base of the bike is fast and light, and that's always a good place to start. You also notice that the, uh, the cable routing is internal, which is like a must for cyclocross. Cyclocross is such an exciting sport. It's kind of like road biking and mountain biking combined with a few, few hurdles thrown in for excitement. So you want a fast handling bike, bigger tires, and plenty of mud clearance. And this frame has all that. I raced on this all last year in the Boulder Cup and just loved this bike. It performed flawlessly all year and I, I got pretty dirty. So let's check some things out here. For starters, we want the SRAM rival uh, shifter and drivetrain. Anybody in the cross circuit will know that SRAM Rival is one of the favorites. It's very affordable and very dependable. Two things cyclists love. It's got a carbon blade on here as well and once again the housing is internal so it's nice and clean. You'll have to dismount during the races and shoulder your bike sometimes and without all the excess housing getting in the way it makes for quicker transfers on and off the bike. Those are sitting on our Tommaso uh, aluminum bar and stem. You also notice that the uh, the brake drops down from the bar. Uh, they're cantilever brakes on a cross bike. They open wider and they allow for better mud clearance. And what's nice about these is they come with uh, micro adjusters uh, on the brake arms themselves. Um, certain racers like to train and race on different wheels. So when they make that change, it's nice to have the adjuster to be able to dial them in right before an event. Speaking of brakes and wheels, we have the core gradient wheels on here. 24 spoke up front, 28 in the rear. Uh, solid wheels, once again, uh, trained on these last year. Very happy with them. They feel great, um, nice and stiff, and uh, they stay true all year. On those, we have the Hutchison Bulldog tires, uh, my personal favorites. Um, just enough tread to get you through the rough stuff, but yet they're still pretty quick. Uh, on the flats and the certain pavement parts. They clear mud really well, and um, they just didn't give me any problems all last year. The drivetrain, we have the SRAM Rival. Um, crank, front driller, and rear driller, really the whole SRAM package. Um, we wanted to give you the best value for the dollar and the best performance. Chain rings here are 46, 38. Um, that gives you a nice cross combination. Smaller than the road, a little bit bigger than the mountain bike gearing, um, because once again, road bike meets mountain bikes, kind of equals cross. So we got you covered on the gearing there. A rival 10 speed front and rear derailleur and the SRAM 1227 cassette. Want to give you as much gearing as possible. There's a lot of sharp ups and downs and cross. Um, you know, having the right gearing is a big, big plus. We're really proud of this package. Uh, we worked hard to, to make it for you. And if you want to try something new, get out and adventure some trails, light trails, or race cross, this is definitely the bike for you. We're very proud of this bike. This is the Tommaso Diavolo.